people that first get to know me and hear some of my stories say, I cannot believe that you went through all of that. I wanted to start telling the story of my life because it's full of drama and craziness and ridiculous stuff. I'm passionate about a lot of things. And one of the things I'm going to tell you right now may be the very thing that makes you click that subscribe button to unsubscribe. I am a conservative Republican. I'm pro-life. I believe in equality for everyone. I believe that all lives matter. But most importantly, I believe that the unborn who don't have a voice matter. I'm very politically active and vocal. And I'm very ashamed of myself recently that I haven't let my voice be heard on YouTube. Knowing that my channel is growing and I have a platform that I built on my voice. My channel was never supposed to be built on how fat I am or how much fat I can lose. My channel was always based from the very beginning on my voice on speaking the truth and speaking out against injustices in the world and trying to protect the little people and fighting for them. That's how my channel started. I was trying to fight against a guy who was an immense power and owned our rental home. He had so much power that he could do anything to us and he did. And I fought against him. And I pissed him off. And I pissed his wife off. And I didn't care. And people were following me through that. But they were following to hate me, to harass me. I got a lot of hate through those videos. Because I spoke my mind. Because I spoke the truth. And people don't want to hear the truth today. And I've been very afraid to speak my mind on my own channel about the things that are happening in the world right now where my voice could be most powerful. But I've been resistant because I don't want to lose you. I've never been afraid to speak my voice. But my channel's growing so quickly and so great. I'm so happy about it. But I'm afraid I'll lose my viewers. Because this is my platform to speak. This is my platform to be who I am. To let my voice be heard. And I'm stifling myself. How ridiculous am I? I want to be able to speak freely about what I believe. And why I believe it. I want to be able to influence people to think about the truth and the facts. I want to influence people for good. That has always been my goal, especially when it comes to women. My stories are powerful. My stories, when they've been heard in large groups, have helped so many women. And yet, I'm not using this platform to tell those stories. I've been superficial. I've scratched the surface. But now that you're here, I want you to stay. I don't want to offend you. But I've never cared about offending people before. But somehow I'm afraid to offend you. Because I like you. I like all of you who have been commenting. And I have to tell you, I'm going to switch gears here for a minute because I want to tell you today's Father's Day. And I want to tell you why this has to do with what I was just talking about as you as my viewers and my subscribers. I've never been loved in my life. My father is one of the most sadistic, mentally, emotionally abusive people I've ever known in my life. And he has caused me immense trauma in my life. 
and maybe I'll tell you those stories someday if you're interested in hearing them because I'm sure I will be posting them in the near future. I've never felt accepted by anybody. I was bullied all my life and now bullied as an adult because of my beliefs. For the first time in my life, I feel accepted by you because you have been so loving and kind and amazing to me. I feel so blessed to have people listen to me. Most people don't listen to me. Most people on Facebook just scroll past me because they don't want to hear what I have to say because I'm always saying it. And you're listening and I feel heard and I feel appreciated and valued and I've never felt that before. That's the honest to God truth. And I think that's why I've been so afraid to veer off from the cavitation machine. Because if you look at my numbers on my videos, you'll notice that my cavitation machine videos are incredibly high. If I post anything else that isn't about the cavitation machine, I'm getting about a 10% viewer rate. What that means is I have 300 subscribers. Right now I have 383, but we're gonna just round it off to 300 so that you can better understand what I'm talking about, a 10% rate. If you go and look at my other videos that are not about the cavitation machine, you'll see that about 30 people watch those videos, which is why my first video, I said only 30 people are gonna watch. Now, some of them are a little bit higher, but not by much maybe 70, maybe 78, maybe 100. But still, when you have 383 subscribers, your viewers should be a little bit higher than a 10% rate. And that's been a little heartbreaking for me because I don't want to be all about the cavitation machine. I want to share my experiences with you but I don't want it only to be about the cavitation machine because that's just a small part of my life, as I said before. And that's why I feel like I need to stop talking about the cavitation machine. I tried a couple other products and I'm gonna give you an update on those here in a minute. But those videos didn't even do very well. So as a YouTuber, you have to pay attention to what's working and what's not working. And the cavitation machine was working for me. I was really excited at first when people were following along my journey and I wanted to keep talking about it because I knew people were excited about it and they were paying attention to it. But now I'm a month into it and there's only so much I can say about the cavitation machine before you will get bored, before I'm extremely over it and I'm really kind of over it I'll tell you a story and as it's relative to this my mom really never paid any attention to me growing up she really didn't like me she very rarely showed me any kind of love or affection or attention and then I started playing guitar and I was really really good at it suddenly my mom started paying attention to me but all she ever wanted me to do was play the guitar and the only time that she wanted me to do that was when she had friends over you show me no love no appreciation no respect nothing until your friends come over and suddenly you love me but you love how I play. You're proud of the fact that I'm good at this and you can show me off. But other than that, I'm nothing to you. And so I quit playing guitar because I knew that was the only thing that my mom liked about me. 
I loved the guitar and I hated it at the same time. And that's kind of how I'm feeling about the cavitation machine right now. I'm loving it and I'm hating it. I'm loving it that you're listening to me, that people are clicking on that subscribe button and you should click on that subscribe button. Not to unsubscribe though. I don't want that to be all that I am to you. And it's not who I want to be. I don't want to forever for the rest of my life talk about fitness and my fat because I am so much more than that and I have so much more to offer to you I want you to know who I am who I really truly am and I want you to be able to connect with me on that level and I hope you will let me tell you a little bit about the shaving machine it sucks Within two days, my hair was growing back already. The facial scrubber, I really like. Um, I just noticed though that my face is starting to break out. Now, I don't know if that's because I'm really finally getting a deep clean. I wanted to give you updates on those for those of you who have been following me. I really want to thank you for those of you who are faithful viewers of mine who are following me because you like me, who are following me because you can relate to me, because you understand me, because there's something about me that you say, wow, I get this chick. She makes sense and I love her personality and I wanna get to know her. I wanna be her friend. I wish I could be her friend. That's why I do these videos. I watched this YouTube video the other day and this guy was talking about how to build your YouTube channel. And he was talking about how he has 4,000 subscribers. And he said out of those 4,000 subscribers, probably 80% of them aren't loyal subscribers. They're not somebody who's gonna come to his channel every single day. Those are what we call faithful, loyal subscribers who are truly going to follow you on every journey you take and are going to watch your videos every time you post because they click the notifications and they're excited for the next video that you're going to be putting out. They can't wait to hear your voice. They can't wait to hear your next story. They can't wait to just know what you're doing next. And that's what I want my channel to be. I want those of you who have subscribed to my channel, who are faithful viewers, to stick with me, thick and thin, to say I may not agree with her, but at least I'm gonna hear her voice. Isn't that what we should do? Isn't that what we're supposed to do? We could build conversations. We don't have to debate and argue, but we can have conversations. We could build a strong community of women with differing opinions and say, you know what? We don't all agree, but we have a common ground. We're women and we want to empower one another and we want to be heard and we want people to know why we want to be heard and what we stand for and what we believe. That's important to us as women and that's important to me. I get very passionate about things and it may sound like I'm angry, it's just my passion coming through. People always misunderstand my passion for anger. So I'm letting you know ahead of time that that's what it is. Sometimes my anger is anger and you will know the difference. <laughs> I have taken the totally long way around town. I even went into the next town north of me in Racine to get to my grocery store, which is only five minutes away from my house. But I also wanted to share with you my heart and my values and why I'm here and why I'm trying to build this channel. I hope that you and your friends will stick with me on this journey together that we can share life together, not just about the cavitation machine, but about all the details of our lives together. If you've commented, you know that I will always comment back to you and I will always start a dialogue with you. And I appreciate all of you who do that. 
And I appreciate all of you who have been sharing my videos. Every time you do that, you tell YouTube I'm worth it. You tell YouTube, shoot her up in the ranks. And I appreciate all of you who do that for me. Cash back base. I'm gonna put a link in my description box. Please feel free to use that link. Now it doesn't give me anything except for points, but points allow me to buy bigger purchases on the site. You're gonna look through their products you're immediately going to get about 2,000 points, and that's gonna allow you to buy some fairly good products. They are affiliated with Amazon. So when you register with Cashback Base, what you're going to do is you're gonna get so many points, look through the products, then you're going to purchase the product. Once you purchase the product and receive it, you then leave a review on that site, but also on Amazon. Once that review has been posted, you get your money back and it will tell you how much money you will get back. Now I purchased the facial scrubber for $27 and I got $22 back. So you might not always get 100% back, but you are gonna get a huge chunk of it back. And there are some really cool products on there for you to get that might be $150 and you'll get $100 back that's a great deal and I'm not gonna make any money off of it I'm just gonna get points for referring you that's it I get nothing out of it truly but I thought I would share it with you because who doesn't like free stuff right I know I love free stuff okay guys I'm gonna go now don't forget thumbs up don't forget to like this video even if you didn't like it give it a thumbs up because you're just like you know what I may not like what she has to say but damn it she's real I am real. I will never ever be fake. I will never lie to you. I will always be real and genuine. I promise you that. Feel free to comment below. I love to read your comments. I absolutely get a kick out of them. I love all of you who are sending me so much love and support. <laughs> I love you guys so much. I really do. So thank you for that. And feel free to share these videos with your friends. I just love all of you so much. I really do. I listen to your voices. I listen to your comments and I hear you. I want you to know I hear you too. Bye.